Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, thank you for coming. I'm Leo Sosta. I'm an early faculty uh, member in the pathobiology department, and I have been a Guelphite since. Uh, okay, since October 2014. So, you know, I don't want to really look self-centered, but I'm going to give you a little bit of background about uh, about my research and uh, about uh, my previous research. What I'm planning to do here at OVC. So I did my DVN degree uh, in Italy at the University of Perugia, about two hours north of Rome, at uh, the end of 2007. And then I was lucky enough <coughs> uh, to work towards my PhD at the University of, uh, University of Georgia in Athens, which is a big poultry hub, as probably a lot of you guys know already. And then I worked towards my PhD with Dr. Corey Brown. Uh, she's, a, she's an alumnus, actually, at the OVC, and she just gave the Shaw Field Memorial Lecture last year in 2014. And uh, during the time, I mostly work on Newcastle disease. And after completing my PhD residency combining veterinary pathology, I worked at the uh, Southeast Poultry Research Lab, which is part of the USDA, is in the same city, Athens, Georgia, all I had to do basically across the road. And in both, uh, during this period, <coughs> I have been working mostly on Newcastle disease virus, NDV, uh, which, as you know, is globally is really a big pro problem uh, for poultry industry. And I was able to work in different aspects of NDV biology, mostly on pathogenesis experiment on different animal species. But I also work with recombinant uh, viruses in order to improve vaccine for Newcastle disease virus. Uh, at the end of this period, I finally uh, reached, uh, <laughs> I reached the OVC. So I'm in the pathobiology department, uh, room 4800, but also have my lab. Um, so what am I doing here uh, at the OVC? So as you all know, uh, a faculty position gives you a lot of freedom, which I think this is what is great about this position. And my research at OVC are uh, uh, multifold, if you will, like of different interests. The first one is a pathologist and therefore as a diagnostician. I would like to uh, work with disease surveillance studies, especially in infectious uh, diseases. And I think that these are a great opportunity to foster collaboration among AHL, for example, or MAFRA, and will allow, uh, will allow us uh, to identify threats, but also to improve diagnostic strategies. Uh, you know, as a pathologist, for example, to better understand what are the presentation of certain diseases or uh, how to improve PCR, or multiplex PCR uh, strategies. And for that, uh, we are uh, just in these few days, we are purchasing a digital droplet PCR. We received the CFI fundings in order to improve diagnostic and sensitivity of uh, molecular diagnostic of poultry diseases. Another thing they're also fond of, if you will, because I've done it during my PhD, is production of recombinant NDV strains. Uh, and trying to do this in order to improve the efficacy of NDV vaccines. For example, by adding additional uh, gene cassettes for uh, adding, for example, cytokines, using them as molecular adjuvants, or even uh, adding microRNA targets in order to modify the tissue tropism of vaccines. Another thing I'm interested in is uh, understanding the determinant of cellular resistance to poultry viruses mostly for NDV, also avian influenza, and uh, with a very long-term goal to select for genetic markers of resistance uh, to create disease-resistant birds. And we are starting doing some preliminary work using haploid cell lines with a genome working strategies in order to see what genes could uh, make those cells resistant to NDV infection or even influenza infection. So these are all great concepts, but what is actually going on in the lab? And uh, during these few months that I've been at OVC, uh, we have a few projects going on. Uh, as uh, Dr. Ayman Saman has outlined before during the morning session, uh, we are working in collaboration with Dr. Michelle Guerin, Chaba Varga, and Marina Brasch at DHL in a prospective survey a study for infectious diseases in non-commercial, non-quota uh, flocks in Ontario, and the project started in October 2015. And this is par partially funded by the Ontario Animal Health Network, and we are trying to get additional money through the OMAFRA. Uh, we are also working uh, in a retrospective study of, of cirrusin birds. I know this is not actually poultry, but this just shows your my interest about avian diseases in general. And this is a retrospective study of about 20 years that has been partially funded by Pet Trust. And we have a DVM student that is working on this project during the summer. 
And uh, out of my startup funds, because really we do not know if we got the money from Antwerp yet, um, working with the recombinant clones of l mostly Lasoda, which is a vaccine strain of NDV in order to introduce extra uh, gene cassettes. And uh, also I'm a pathologist, so I'm doing collaborative research and supportive pathology research uh, with uh, other collaborators here at the University of Guelph, but also at the University of Georgia at the USDA. And I'm doing immunohistochemistry and, and reading the h &E slides for these studies and also performing intestinal histomorphometry. So if you guys need a pathologist to read your slides of your studies, contact me. And uh, of course also we have quite a few people in the labs and uh, of course a postdoc, Dr. Linda, that I would like really to thank because he's doing a lot of work in our, in our lab. Dr. Eman Saman who was here this morning that is taking the lead on the prospective surveillance study and uh, project students and, uh, and summer students in the lab. And finally, I would like to acknowledge as people in the lab or collaborator, uh, Dr. Michelle Guerin, Chaba Varga and, uh, uh, and Marina Brush, they really uh, helped me a little bit to get into the poultry uh, group or niche here at uh, University uh, of Guelph. And uh, with this, I will thank you.